Hey, what's up, guys? We're playing Pokemon again. We just beat the Elite Four. We're back in Pallet Town. We've got some um, after game stuff to do, so let's get started. Ah, Red, you're back, are you? How much have you filled in your Pokedex? May I see it? Let's see. You've caught 122. Now, this is impressive. There's something I wanted to ask of you, Red. Come, follow me. And we're. I'm pretty sure you guys know this from the way I play games, but we are going to finish the entirety of the Pokedex. Um, at least Kanto. Obviously not the National Dex. Recently there have been sightings of many rare Pokemon species. I'm talking about Pokemon that have never been seen in Kanto. I would love to go see things for myself, but I'm much too old. Since I can't do it, Red, I'd like you to go in my place. Hey, I heard that. What's with favoring Red over me all the time? I went and collected more Pokemon on Faster too. You should just let me handle everything. I know, I know. Of course I need your help too. Now, I need to see both your Pokedexes. And that's done. Now these units can record Pokemon data on a lot more Pokemon. Now, Red and Blue, this time you must really work towards filling your Pokedexes. I urge you to make them the best and the most complete of all time. Truly, this is a monumental great undertaking in Pokemon history. Gramps, calm down. Don't get so excited. I'll get the Pokedex completed. Don't you worry about it. I think I'll try looking around one island first. Anyways, I'm out of here. Can I take this? That's Prozo's last Pokemon. Okay. Sorry. Um. Okay, so, um... Now we can head down to one island and do Mount Ember, but before we do that, um, we're gonna go ahead and trade in some Pokemon from Fire Red um, to start completing the Pokedex. Pokedex. So, because now I do want to finish obviously Kanto's decks here. So, what we're gonna do? Um, let's go ahead and deposit our Pokemon deposit let's go ahead and put our champion team in 14 okay then let's go ahead and withdraw so I got a bunch of feeder Pokemon basically to trade with so a couple of sand shrews of two Vulpixes and then we just got to do one more deposit. We'll go ahead and deposit Starmie in 14. Withdraw. Okay. And then we can give away a Pidgey. Okay. So, of course, we are on this game. Let's go ahead and head up to the trading center. So this is, of course, the copy that you guys know that I've been playing on. Um alongside my leaf green okay guys i just had to do a couple of really quick things but um now i went ahead and i got both games up so um let's go ahead and use trade center we would like to save okay let's go ahead and overwrite that okay we walk forward with our fire red copy um whoop. okay um i would like to trade save yep all right go ahead go ahead and do whatever you need to do right then and I've got six Pokemon to trade over, and I'll show you guys what they are in a little bit. All right, here we go. We got the enter screen, finally. Okay, so player one, which is my leaf green copy, will go here. Player two, which is my fire red copy, will go there. And we will go ahead and trade some Pokemon. So um, what I want to do is I want to trade the ones from A over to red. So, um, let's see, how do I do this? I want to trade that Sand Shrew for the Growlithe. Oops, not Summary, and I'm going to do that a lot. Growlithe, and go ahead and trade that. Is it trade okay? Yes, yes. And I got to do this for all six, so I'm probably just going to speed montage it.
Alright everybody, a little while later, let's go ahead and check it out what I traded. So, on my Leaf Green official YouTube account, um, I went ahead and traded over a Growlithe, a Shelder, a Hitmonlee, a Scyther, an Ammonite, and a Psyduck. So let's kind of go through um, each of them. The Growlithe is a, um, an exclusive, the Shelder is an exclusive, the Psyduck is an exclusive, the Ammonite is not an exclusive, but you only get one per game, so I traded over the other one. The Hitmonlee, once again, not an exclusive, but you get one per game, so I traded over another one. And the Scyther is an exclusive inside the Safari Zone. So there is six new Pokemon, but um, now it is time to evolve the Growlithe, the Shelder, um, the Ammonite, and the Psyduck. The only ones that don't have to be um, evolved is Hitmonlee and Scyther. So um, I'm going to go over to... Um, the PC here. Let's go ahead and deposit. We can deposit the Scyther. We can deposit the Hitmonlee. We will keep the rest. Let's go ahead and withdraw. All we need to withdraw is Starmie here. I'm gonna withdraw Starmie. And then let's grab one more Pokemon that we need to evolve. Okay, and then I guess let's go ahead and grab the Weedle. Because, ironically enough, we still need to evolve the Weedle. Okay, so, um, now it is time to do a lot of evolution. So let's go ahead and take our Pokemon. Ooh, I do not have my Pidgeot. Okay, never mind. Let's go grab Pidgeot. Okay, so I am here back at Victory Road, and I'm going to go ahead and, um... Stick the XP share. Gotta go all the way down. Go all the way down. XP share. We're gonna go ahead and give it to um, people one at a time. So Psyduck is first. Um, just because Psyduck's at 33, so it'll evolve one, basically one level later. Okay, here we go. Psyduck level 34. So that'll go ahead and get us the Gold Duck. And then, once we evolve these four Pokemon, we'll go ahead and grab Weedle, Caterpie, and Poliwag. And then we'll need to evolve those ones also. And then we'll have a good majority of the um, Pokedex done. I, I'll have to look at who else we're missing at that point. Okay, so we went ahead and now we have the Gold Duck. So we can take that. We'll go ahead and give Growlithe the XP share now. And Growlithe, um, would you like to switch? Yes. Okay. And the Growlithe needs to get to 36, so this one's going to be a little bit. All right, here we go. Growlithe, level 36. That should... Ooh, what? It needs a Firestone, doesn't it? All right, well, oops. Well, I just gave it a lot of levels, I think, for no apparent reason. So that's pretty cool. Cool. Well, I gave Starmie some more levels, so I guess not the worst thing on the planet, but oops. And now we got a level 36 Arcanine, so a little stronger Arcanine, you know, not going to say no to that. All right, let's go ahead and um, take the XP share off of that. Go ahead, give the XP share to Shelder. And, wait, um, yep, Shelder was given XP share. Real quick, just before I do anything else, it doesn't evolve by Waterstone, does it? Um, it does evolve by Waterstone, okay. Well, then I didn't need to give it that. Um, so, next, we need to do the Ammonite. Ammonite evolves at level 40. We've got a long way to go. It's 5 right now, so. Alright, we got ourselves... A Cloyster. Cool. Alright, so, we go back here. Bang bong. We got Cloyster, Gold Duck, Arcanine. Okay, let's go ahead and take that. Oop, actually, Ammonite is level 9. 
So not terrible. Alright, let's go ahead and give Ammonite XP share, and um, here we go. Alright, here we go. Ammonite, level 40. Here we go. Oh, so much, so much leveling up. Oh. But it's okay. We're getting through it. We're getting through it. Ammonite is evolving into... Boom, boom, boom. I'm a star. This is a very ugly little snake, or snake, ugly little snail. Very ugly snail. That is one in the morning. Uh, spike cannon. Sure, we'll teach you spike cannon. Um, nope, never mind. We will not teach you spike cannon. Yes. Okay, cool. So, let's take a look at the Pokemon. Oyster, I'm a star. Gold Duck, Arcanine. So, let's go ahead and, um... Get out our next set of Pokemon. I'm gonna fly over to here. Let's go ahead and we can bank them. Go ahead and bank these Pokemon. Alright, let's go ahead and start depositing them. Box four. Boing, boing. Okay, now we need to withdraw a couple of Pokemon. Alright, so let's take a look at what we need to evolve. Um, we can start with Weedle, Caterpie, Poliwag, I think, oh, and Executor, and Execute. Alright, and I think that might be all we need to evolve, actually, because I think everything else is done. So let's go ahead and evolve these. Okay! Here we go again! Execute level 36! Don't tell me it's another one with the leaf stone, bro! Don't, don't, don't say it. Am I dumb? Uh, I keep. Okay. Oh. I'm spending so much time evolving them and just not double checking, and wow, I'm wasting so much time. Okay. That's fine. Here we go. No problem. Alright, we got ourselves an Execute. And it turned into an Executor. Okay, so let's go ahead and take um, the item off that. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and give it to Poliwag. Alright, here we go! Uh, Poliwag got it up to level 25, and it should be evolving into Poliwhirl. Congratulations, your Poliwag evolved into a Poliwhirl. Now question, does this evolve with a water stone before I... anything else? It does. I thought it did. Alright, Poliwhirl is evolving into... into a Poliwrath. Alright. Got ourselves a Poliwrath. Congratulations, your Poliwhirl evolved into a Poliwrath. Pretty cool. Okay, let's go ahead and take it from Poliwrath. Go ahead and give it to Weedle. And we will go ahead and get Caterpie and Weedle both up to their final evolutions. And then we'll be... Then we'll, we'll have to check the Pokedex and go from there. Pop fans. So oh, okay. I'm like in the middle of a video. Okay, here we go. Weedle's evolving. I didn't realize it would evolve that quickly. All right. And it evolved into... Kakuna. Alright, now I gotta get this Kakuna into Beedrill. Oh, it's evolving already! Why Why does this thing evolve so quickly? Alright, well, anyway, it's evolving. Kakuna turned into Beedrill. Here we go! Alright, your Kakuna evolved into a Beedrill. That evolved very, very quickly. Alright, well, that is done. Okay, let's go ahead and take... The XP share off of that. Go ahead and give it to Caterpie. 
Yeah, it apparently evolves at level 10. Which is nuts to me. That seems like that's, like, not very high. Um, so I might even, like, let's just do a couple battles together and I might not even cut here. It's gonna get to level 7, like, very, very quickly. Yep, Caterpie. Yep, level 4. Level 5. Level 6. Will it get to even level 7? Okay, it won't get to level 7, but... I was pretty close. I wouldn't even be surprised if we get one of the big boys, we can just get it straight to level 10. Okay. Um, we can go ahead and psychic it. That's fine. Oh, and there actually is one other Pokemon we need to grab. Um, I do have a Charmeleon. Um, we could grab that Charmeleon. But right now, Caterpie is evolving. Bum, 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 bum. Into Metapod. For Metapod, it'll be a Butterfree at level 10, which is not far. And it's... I bet a lot of you guys are very, like, weirded out that I have Chansey, I have Scyther, I have everything, but I don't have Metapod and Butterfree, but, um, I just never bothered to use either Caterpie or, um, Weedle. I just never bothered. I don't, you know, I, I never had that desire to use a bug Pokemon. The second I got Nidoran, I used Nidoran, you know. All, all I really needed in the beginning was Squirtle, Nidoran. Really now, the only Pokemon that we should get for the Pokedex is... Um... The Charmander and the Bulbasaur lines. Those... Oh, we need to grab the Eevees too. So we'll need to uh, breed some Eevees. That's the other thing. So I can make... Um, Jolteon and Vaporeon. Okay, cool. So, let's go ahead and, um, Pidgey our way back here. Okay, back to the Indigo Plateau. Yeet. Alright, so let's go ahead over to the box. So, we now have Beedrill, Butterfree, Polyrath, and Executor. Go ahead and stick them back in the box. Actually, wait, before we do that, let's go take a look at our Pokedex. So, once again, let's go to Kanto. We're missing Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Venusaur, Charmander, Charizard. But are we missing anything else? So far, it does not look like it. It looks like we have most of them. Uh, like I said, we're probably missing... Okay, so we need Gengar still. So we're missing Gengar. We need Seedra. We need Jinx, 125, whatever that is. One, and then probably Jolteon. Jolteon, Vaporeon. And that should be it. And then we, I think, need Mewtwo and something else. Okay, so... um. I wrote down everything we need. So we need a Bulbasaur, a Charmander, we need to trade Haunter, Siege to level 32, we need to trade for a Jinx, we need to grab an Electabuzz, two, two, two EV evolutions, and Mewtwo. And then... I don't know about Mew, but we'll see. Um, but... Yeah, so for now, I'm gonna... I have to work on my Fire Red account to grab a few of those. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna withdraw Dragonite, we're gonna withdraw Machamp, we're gonna withdraw Needle King, and then I think the only one that I can do right now is Seedra. So let's go ahead and grab our horsey. I don't know where I left my horsey, but that's the only one that we can evolve now, and I'm just gonna evolve it while we're doing the other stuff. Okay, everybody, so I couldn't find my other horsey, so I just, I went and grabbed another one. Um, let's go ahead and give it the XP share. So while we do everything, 
um, else will go ahead and evolve that horsey, and the rest of them I'll have to work on my fire, uh, fire green account, my fire red account. Um, so let's go ahead and grab Pidgey, and we gotta fly over to, what town was it again? What town was it? Um, Vermilion, yeah, that's the one. I'm like, yeah, I definitely, I, I think I've recorded like, um, like, couple, like nine, ten hours today, so I think I need to go to sleep, but let's go ahead and get started on the quest at least. Um, let's get the quest at least started, and then I'll probably, this could be definitely the, the, my last episode, and I'll pick it back up tomorrow. Well, let's at least start what we're doing here. Oh, wait a minute. I think I need to go to Oak first. Well, you could tell I'm tired because we already talked to Oak. That's not who I'm looking for. I'm looking for Celio. Let's go ahead and talk to Celio here. Red, how are things been for you? Is that alright? You've caught more Pokemon. Do you know what? Maybe I can be useful to you. I'm modifying the network machine right now. I'm changing it so it can handle trades over long distances. When I get finished, you'll be trading for exotic Pokemon from trainers far away, but there's a light catch. For the link to work, the machine needs a special gemstone. It's supposed to be on one island, but I haven't found it yet. Who knows where it could be? Okay, that is probably at Mount Ember, right? That would, like, make sense. So... Let's go ahead and do that. Um, go ahead and heal. And I don't think there's new... Oh, it was probably where those one Team Rocket people were, right? I think so. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, head back to that area. Let's go ahead and quickly just use a, re a repel. Um, where is Max Repel? Yep, let's go and do that. Just because I really, I don't want to be um, attacked by a bunch of Tentacool right now. Alright, so we are at Mount Ember. Now if we go over here, there was some Team Rocket. Whew, punch through at last. Let's go treasure hunting. Any treasure we find, we haul back to the warehouse. Understood? Oh. What are the passwords at the Team Rocket warehouse, I mean? What? You forgot the password. There are actually two. The first one's Goldeen. Need log. The second one is... Hey, this is... Snoop's been listening in. Trying to corner on our treasure? Don't bet on it. Oh, I didn't realize we were fighting. Okay, that's fine. about stepping inside here if you know what's good for you don't even think about this okay guys we're gonna go ahead and end this episode off here i am <laughs> very very tired so yes i will see you guys tomorrow